Shane, I know you love other sports. What's what are you most excited about as we move forward in the sports calendar? Well, let's, well, obviously we got opening day coming up in a couple of days, and I'm sure you guys are definitely definitely talking about. Well, Mike, I know you're talking about the Yankees. Yeah. Um, you know that's that's more of where I mean, you know, you know, see, you know, now that Judge is healthy, I mean that's awesome. You know, with him being healthy, we can and Staten, uh, you know, I'll I'll reach out there. Both can hit over 50 home runs this year. You know, in addition, you got what? You got Paxton, right? He's helping the rotation yeah, out. Absolutely. Servino. Um, well, I'm just trying to go off, go off stuff off the top of my head. Jay Hat. Um, the, yep. Andujar, right? Yep. They're 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 in and good they, shape. And the good thing I like about the young guns is, you know, this is now their second year. They got the first year under their belt. Now they're really ready to go and settle in. Um, and then, you know, from from the bullpen aspect, you got um, uh, what is it? Chapman. Batanzas. Yeah. Chat, Chapman, Batanzas, Brighton, um, and Ottavino, is that how you pronounce yeah, it? Yeah, Ottavino, yep. Ottavino. I mean, on paper, it looks like you have both pitching and you got the field and hitting. I mean, the Yankees are definitely in the conversation, should win the division and go all the way. Now, if you're scouting Stanton and Judge, who do you think makes a better wrestler? Now, Stanton, by the way, reminds me a lot of The Rock. He's got that same yeah. look, the same expression. Yeah, um, both are different, you know, as just as they are their personalities. I'll tell you a quick digression with uh, with Judge. His rookie year, uh, my spring break was around this time. My sons and I were all checking in. My wife, we were checking into uh, the airport, and this gentleman was behind us. And I, I I forget where he's from, but he was heading home. West Coast. Um, and my okay, and my boys my boys were looking around. They said, "Hey, you know." I was like, oh, and so I recognize them quickly, and they say, I don't know who it is. I said, well, go introduce yourself. So we did. My sons did. And the nicest guy, I mean, it reminded me a lot of Jeter, having met Jeter several times. Just that humble, um, down-to-earth, like literally he would, you know, if you needed help with your luggage, he would help you and pick it up and do that. So, I mean, what a great guy. So I root for him all the time just because of the type of human being he is. Plus the immense amount of talent, uh, so I'm psyched that he's healthy and back, back in business. Did you have you ever had a conversation with Hal Steinbrenner? I feel like you guys might be able to relate in terms of the experience with your respective fathers. And also, George was a big wrestling fan. Yeah, right. And George was uh, buddies with Bobby the Brain yeah. Heenan, was a big wrestling fan, etc. Oh yeah, and my dad. Yeah, so yeah, the answer is yes. Um, we run into each other a couple times, you know, at some of those sports conventions and uh, and functions. So yeah, there's definitely a definitely a correlation between our fathers, which is uh, which is which is interesting. They're definitely cut from the same type of cloth. Shane, we thank you for coming on. I know you're crazy busy today. Good luck tonight. Uh, stay safe and uh, good luck in WrestleMania against Miz. I'm gonna have to root for a bad guy. I'm loving it. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you guys for having me on.